Hello and welcome to Gary Mation. This is a short series of 10 video casts offering hints and tips on how to get the best from your PowerPoint videos. As we now have Accelerate to help our people learn quickly and easily, it's never been so important to ensure that our materials are vibrant, modern, engaging and entertaining. The first video is all about colour and backgrounds. One of the best ways to improve your, your PowerPoint presentations is the, probably the easiest way of all, to avoid using a white background. Everybody in this business will be using white backgrounds for the presentations and there's really no reason why we should. Um, let me quickly show you how you how you change that. The first thing is go up to design, which is in the tab function at the top. Once you've clicked that, it'll give you loads of different options. I'm just going to change the background color. You can do that by clicking on format background, click on it, it gives you a drop down box, opens up a new pane and just go into colors. Now, any of the design websites that I've been looking at recently are always suggesting sort of pastel colours and that sort of thing. So I'm just going to use this sort of yellowy, orangey colour, which which I quite like. Now, one of the big issues when you when you use a coloured background in a presentation is whenever you add in an image, obviously your images tend to have white backgrounds. But worry not, this is no longer an issue. It's one of the most unprofessional things you can see is when you see a white background on a coloured uh, a coloured slide, but let me show you how you can how you can fix that and never have this problem ever again. Um, the first thing to do is double tap on the on your image, and once you do that, it goes to format. The tabs go to format the section. On the top left up here, you can see there's a box that actually gives you an option to remove background. What we want to do is click on that, and what it does is it all the the sort of white section into purple. And what I'm going to do is just move these lines to actually take in the, the area that we want to keep. Now, as you can see, it doesn't actually do everything. You can see that there's a gap, a space underneath the car. So I'm just going to zoom in slightly to that so I can see it a bit better. Up here in the top, it says mark areas to remove. So the software does the majority of the hard work. It finds the edges, but there are wee bits and bobs that you might need to do yourself. Simply click on that and draw the line where you want to remove. So I'm just doing underneath the car. There we go. There's a bit of this became purple. There we are. And just colour in. It only takes a couple of moments, but it's very, very worthwhile. Uh, and I'm just going to remove this bit in the bumper here. And just a bit extra cheeky. I'm going to do the windows. That wee back window there anyway. Okay, then you just click um, Keep Changes. There you go. I'm just going to zoom out. And now you can see your car has no white background which is pretty good news from a design point of view. Hopefully you'll agree that that looks considerably better. A little bit funkier and a little bit more modern and vibrant than just a typical everyday white background PowerPoint slide. Thanks so much for taking the time to watch this video. The second video in the series will be how to make the most of your text. Um, so stay tuned for that. Thanks very much.